All right, Chicago Bear fans, it never ends, does it? Now we have another report from Jason saying that Chicago Bears had internal discussions about Ben Roethlisberger before he agreed to stay with the Steelers. Ben Roethlisberger, he's old. You really want to get a really old quarterback? Is that how desperate they are? If this is true, this is so short-sighted that you want to get a quarterback on his last leg, I hope this isn't true because that means they're too desperate. Um, Number two, the Bears are prepared to throw a boatload of picks to acquire Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson. So desperation, no doubt. Why not? You are the Chicago Bears. You've never had a quarterback. You're desperate. Your jobs are on the line. And at this point in time, what wouldn't you be willing to do to get Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson? So if we look at Russell Wilson, the problem, he's 32 years old. That's your problem. But he is a really good quarterback. Last year, 40 touchdowns, 13 picks. Look at the numbers before that. So you look at his career, he's really only had one eh year as far as touchdown to interceptions. That was 2016. Other than that, he's done very well. These are numbers that, as Chicago Bear fans, we would have loved to seen. I'll say this, and I think people will agree with me. If Russell Wilson was the Chicago Bear quarterback this whole time, I do believe the Chicago Bears have a few Super Bowl championships under their belt with him at quarterback. But he's 32 years old. If the Bears get him, I'll be very happy because this is a huge upgrade over Mitch Trubisky and Nick Foles. Deshaun Watson, he's 25 years old. So I like that situation better. And we look at what he's done early on. So we look, and he's done quite well early on. So came out as a rookie, and then we see what he's done. 2019, that 26 and 12. You want to see better than that, though. But last year, came back with that 33 and 7. And last year, he didn't even have one of the best receivers in football because they traded him. So still put up those numbers. So if they get him, I'm going to be really, really happy, very excited. Um, 33-7, and that works for me. And I think the Chicago Bears are a better team than the Texans, so I think he could do even better with them. And the big thing is he's 25. So my first option is Deshaun Watson because he's 25. I'd be very excited. We'd have the best quarterback we've ever had in franchise history. If we can't get him, we get Russell Wilson. I'm still very excited. Even though he's 32, maybe we have four, maybe four years of an elite quarterback left. I'll take those four years. So. Yeah, this is where we're at. So I hope they weren't trying to get Ben Roethlisberger because, like I said, he's he's on his last leg. He's so old that there's no way I want him to be the quarterback of the Bears. And so as far as your Jimmy Garoppolo, your Sam Darnold, your Carson Wentz, absolutely not. If you got any of those guys... The coach is fired. The GM is fired. The fans are irate. Don't even bother. There's only two choices here. And I speak on behalf of all Chicago Bear fans. I'm pretty sure. It's either going to be Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson as our quarterback. And if it takes two number one picks to do it, don't hesitate. Because let's be honest. Have you looked at who the Bears have selected with the first pick overall in the draft? The chances of the Bears picking anyone good is like slim and none. The chances of them drafting a Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson is zero, no shot. 
So why not trade a couple of number ones for a player that would be better than both of your number ones that you would have picked combined? We know this is a fact. So without hesitation, I would do whatever it takes to get Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson. Preferably, give me the younger guy, Deshaun Watson. But we'll see what happens. Let me know in the comments which one of these quarterbacks do you want. I'm going to guess it's Deshaun Watson since he's 25, but let me know. But every day we hear these stories, we see this, we get excited, we get hopeful. As a Chicago Bear fan, if we would have had a Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson as our QB, we would have won some Super Bowls already. No doubt about it. So Matt Nagy, this is his first head coaching job. He should have been fired, most people would say, but he gets another chance. He's not going to take his last chance with Mitch Trubisky and Nick Foles. Believe me, he's in Ryan Pace's office, and he is begging him, do whatever it takes to get Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson. And Ryan Pace, his first GM job, he doesn't want to be fired. So believe me. He's in there. He's working it all out. He's getting things together. He's calling them. You don't want to sound desperate, but let's be honest. The Texans, the Seahawks, they know the Bears are desperate. So you're in a bad situation. The whole world knows you're desperate for a QB, and you can't hide it. It is what it is. You've never had a quarterback, and if you have a chance to get one, You got to get one, whatever it takes, honestly, especially one that's 25 years old. If you got to move something you don't want to move, do it anyway. Because let's be honest, the Chicago Bears cannot draft a quarterback. It is impossible. They cannot do it. So this is the only way they can get a quarterback. So you do what you have to do. One day I'm going to wake up and I'm going to see the news. Deshaun Watson is traded or Russell Wilson is traded to the Chicago Bears. And I'm not going to care what it took. The only thing I'm going to care about is that Deshaun Watson or Russell Wilson is our quarterback. And because of that, the Chicago Bears have a legit shot at winning a Super Bowl because they have a quarterback. And that right there is worth it. But let me know in the comments what do you think. I'm done. Let's go Bears.